I hear word that Liu Bei has defeated Cao Cao at Han Zhong. With the land divided, the time to take out Cao Cao is drawing near. Yeah. Liu Bei. He has been most valuable. A trustworthy ally. But my lord, how long can that continue? If Fu is to one day rule the land, then... You must open your mind. The future of this land may be in a form we have not yet dreamed of. Not yet dreamed of? It is so good to see you here. You did it! I knew you had it in you! No, I still have much to learn. But now, I have the chance to fight under your command again. What are you talking about? I said it's up to you now! You remember? But, but brother... Come on! Show us the path on which you will lead Wu! The path to glory! Ha! The victory at Hefei greatly expanded the battle lines with the Ming province. Zhang Liao and the Wei officers gathered together their defeated troops and fled to Shouchun. This was the perfect chance to eliminate Wei from Yang province. However, the main army led by Sun Quan was exhausted from all the, all the fighting. Just then, Sun Jian and Sun Se returned to the field. Once again, the father and brother had come to bear the, their claws in battle. When faced with an inspiring display, Sun Quan placed them in charge of driving off Wei. Meanwhile, having learned from his defeat at Hefei, Cao Cao immediately prepared his next move. He trusted a large detergent of reinforcements to Cao Pi and advanced his forces at Shouchun. No matter the size of the army the enemy prepared, he simply had to beat them through their sheer might alone. Sun Se, Sun Jian, Zhou Yu, and Tai Chu prepared to do battle in the fields of Shouchun. Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to another episode of Dynasty Warriors 8 on the PS4 aka Wu Story Mode but this time we have finally entered the what if route on this story thanks to the brave and daring efforts of Ling Tong in the last battle using the time stone to prevent a tragic disaster Luckily, and resulting him to emerge victorious for the forces of Wu, driven off Zhang Liao in the defending troops that was positioned at Hefei. Other than that, here we are, the pursuit of Shouchun, a totally new area that we have yet to come across to. So let's see what we have here, as you can tell. The two familiar faces that return in this story is none other than Sun Se and Sun Jian. Although, I won't be playing these two or show you today. So, having to regret not playing them in Wu Story Mode's canyon route, I want to play as Taisha Se, courtesy name Ziyid. And as you can see here, I unlocked both of Taishisho's final weapons, 5-star Demon Rods and 6-star Frozen Demon Rods. Anywho, I hope this is a effective weapon setup for Taishisho here. So, if, if so, I believe he should be all ready to go. Let's start the battle. Duty does not fade. Let us go to battle. Hey, aren't we getting a little carried away? 
away. It's good to strike while the iron is hot. But we've taken our own losses, too. That's not like you, my lord. I thought seizing the momentum was your specialty. Besides, we may never get another chance like this. Chance? I see. If we move the battle lines up from Buffet, we can bring Shochu under our command. That will give Janye further protection, and at the same time, open the way to Shu Chong. Yes, Wei is also surely aware of this. If we pause for breath now, it will strengthen the defenses of Shochun. Is that so? Then there's only one thing left to do. Yes, we can't let Chuan shoulder everything. Come, let our fangs tear open a path for the young tiger. Yes, father, I'm with you. All right, let's get this started, shall we? We shall expel Wei from young brothers. Everybody, advance. Master Sun Tzu and the others have returned to the battle. This is a great moment for Wu. Ha <laughs> ha, Tai Shen Tzu. I couldn't be happier to fight by your side. Likewise, Master Shun Tzu. Long have I been waiting for this turn to come. Come on, what are you waiting for? Let's get this fight started. Alright, for starters, Tai Shen Tzu's basic combo attack. Oh, that guy forgot closing later. <laughs> Charge three. It's supposed to stun. Charge two with the first EX. Oh, let's see that again. I want to use that against Tap Three here. Bingo. Nice going. Keep it up. Following their victory, Zhong Liao, I leave the defense of our rear guard to you. He's making a run for it. However, I won't let him get away. Switch attack, charge jump attack, regular jump attack, charge four, which is a projectile attack, a wind. Cyclone projectile yeah. attack. Take down the bridge. That will prevent them from giving the chase. Joshu has arrived and is leading a unit of Shang Wei troops. Let's get this over with already. <laughs> They've left such an important place virtually undefended. Okay, let's give them all a big surprise. They're targeting our main camp. You must protect Master Xu Quan. I did not think I would be receiving any reinforcements. Try and stop that us turn. Keep that storm rush going. You are unstoppable. Can we actually go inside this castle here? Let me see. Is this gate open? Attacking the main camp. We must hold out against their assault. in the north is acting suspiciously. I shall go and see what they're up to. Everybody else, hurry to the aid of the main camp. Well, hold up a sec, King Fong. I want to see if we can go inside this fort. Oh, I guess the other gate's closed too. Man. Okay. Guess we'll head back to the main camp. Also, ladies and gentlemen, you are listening to End This Fight. That's today's battle track. And I believe this... 
track originally played in Dynasty Warriors 3. Hold on, let's backtrack here. The Bing Fong did say that the, the forces up here in the north are suspicious. Oh, there's a mobile unit captain here, let's get rid of him. Maybe he's being sus. Oh, here they come. Ooh, did lock. Get that first moose out going. Oh, yeah. Hey, frozen place. How about we show off the air moose out this time? Let's get both of these guys if possible. Ah, oh, of course, we will shoot blocked it. Charge fire for the second yet. Much like the roaring waters of nature. So the enemy is still nearby. I shall go and deal with them personally. Okay, now we can go inside the fort. You know what? In this alternate timeline, I'm pretty sure Taisu Shu wants to take vengeance of what happened to him. <laughs> I will claim vengeance for our defeat at Hefei. Come, prepare to meet your end. Part 6, which is a grab move. Let's get help. No, you don't, Zhang Liao. Get stolen with Zhang Liao. This here. Oh, thought that was an attack boost. Oh, get away from you. Alright, Chang Liao. Oh, ouch. Take this. Hey, back. <gasps> he survived that. No, no, no. We have to. We have to at least land that on Zhang Liao, personally. Come on now. It's more fitting, if you ask me. There you go. So that's Taisha Su's second missile attack. That's a very a super effective grab move. With the right weapon set up, of course. That's why I have the weapon 2 set up for. Get rid of these mobile unit captains so they don't cause problems for Ding Fong here. Thank you, Xu Shuang. Alright, let's backtrack to the main camp. It does seem like they're not having any issues back at the main camp. Yeah, I thought so. Hmm. This isn't good. I think we had better withdraw for now. The main camp is secure at last. Now we need to keep an eye out for enemy traps while we chase after South P. I am continually impressed by both father and brother. Oh, I thought there'd be somebody in this fort here. I mean, then these peons. Who's that? Oh, just a gatekeeper. Let's take down Shuffle Wei way here. Mm-hmm, that's what you think, Shuffle Wei. Can I catch you with this? I most surely you can. Awesome. Go follow it up with the basic combo attack. All 
I don't even know why I picked up that speed up buff. That's another thing I this game has a drawback too. The small drawback is um, if you pick up the winged boots to get that speed buff, we're not going to like the outcome of this encounter. And it doesn't increase your speed while you're on horse, unfortunately. I wonder why they didn't carry that over from the W7. You know. All right, Eugene, take this. But yeah. How could I let them surprise me like this? Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. He turned into gold. And I'll take his weapon. They certainly did make Tytrissa uh, in these games now very slow now compared to he was in the old Warriors games. I shall return after reviewing my strategy. Well done. I couldn't do better myself. Thank goodness they have the freedom to make his weapons here to have attack speed because he needs that. I'll just stop hitting me in the back with you, please. Storm rush going. Sal's in here. Now let into submission. Pounded into submission. You mean bonked into submission, Tychusa? <laughs> That's pretty much what these twin rods do, just bonk enemies until they've been uh, taken, or rather, they die. Such a vivid display of raw power, much like the roaring waters of nature. All right, let's get a move on. I thought you might be coming this way. This is where you die. God, ambush, huh? It's a trap. You must hurry and finish off these enemies here. Hmm. Let's see if we can gather all the ambush troops together. I do want to land a rage missile on all of these guys? Okay, you two, I need you to follow me here. So Hong Shun Yu. Shun Yo. New Jin. Oh, ouch. Can we leave? Lee Dian's over here? Yep, it's totally over here. You join the party too, Lee Dian. Wanna land an awesome Ridge Moose style attack on all five of you here. I think this should be good to go. Well, I got most of them, certainly. Surprisingly, shouldn't you survive that? You won't any longer with this. Get destroyed, shouldn't you? Get yeeted up in the air. <laughs> okay, I guess we don't have to go that way. I will patrol the surrounding area. Ah, there you are. Now, attack! Try and stop me! Heal up yeah. a little bit. I guess we have no choice but to beat them back before we can resume our advance. Ooh. Wind pain in from you. No, you don't. Like 
gonna land the air myself on both of you here. Hey, I did it. Nicely done, Tasha. So bonked into submission. What you meant to say, Tasha. So. <laughs> I should put that in the Enemy video description. Hey, frozen. In place. Don't think you won. Pound it into submission. I will oh, do what you think. Just try and get past me if you can. Very well. If you wish to stand against me, I shall simply beat you back down. Oh, he escaped that with his air moves off, surprisingly. Oh, can I catch him in midair? Oh, that's great. <laughs> get yeeted, you Asian. Where's his body go? Oh. just need to give it one last push. There is no need to rush things, so the tiger never lets down his guard when on a hunt. No! Drown the enemy in a beautiful sea of arrows! Let's get this over with already! We will not be able to advance until we defeat that enemy. Well done! I couldn't do better myself! Walking won't save your life any longer, Punk Pal. Oh, nice. Let's grab this. Sao Chun. Ooh. Hold up. Nice. Thank you, Shou Yu. I really appreciate inspiring. I'm going to have your head. Alright, that's so so strong. Her here, stop, stop firing the arrows upon us. I don't want to deal with archers right now, in my opinion. Get them out of here. Gotta watch out too, because Jung has that super. Oh, yikes. He has that super scene battle aura, right, it seems. I know I keep on saying that, but really, I think it's called Hyper Berserk <laughs> mode in this game, officially. But whatever, I like to call it Super Saiyan Battle Aura. It's more epic that way, if you ask me. He yeeted! Yeeted into submission this time. Oh, ouch. Oh, in case you're wondering why the enemies are purple, it's because it's slowing down the movement speed. Uh, let's heal up what's in here. Oh, nice. Could use some of that. What do we got here? Some easy sauce and die by me. Whoa. I see Dunga on me. Hey, you're frozen in place and you can't do anything about it. Pound it into submission. 
Bonk into submission. Bonk or yeeted into submission. I'm gonna watch out for that. Cool. That was a close one if you ask me. Ooh, get away from Sauron. And he has so much defense too. Which makes sense. He's a Gundam after all. A tanky Gundam, if you ask me. Alright, let's go ahead and put an end to Sal P here. Clay pot here. Nice, full recovery. <laughs> so shame. <laughs> you seen this? <laughs> That's slow mo death. Right. I think we gotta stop fooling around and finally defeat Salty here. And then it's this battle. No, you don't sell Pete. I use my air moose out too. I'm gonna hit the grab moose on him. Ah, oh, they didn't kill him. Come on, guys, we gotta land that to finish off this battle. Move here, sell Pete. No, I grabbed the wrong person. Oh. Magnificent. Father. Brother. There you are. We were just finishing up. You broke through the enemy defenses with no more men than this? I knew it. You should be the one leading Wu. I give everything back to you. <sighs> what are you talking about? It's only thanks to you that we've made it this far. But... But... Now, Wu is united under your grand ideals. All we can do is support you and help however we can. Brother, please. Father, can't you convince him? <laughs> I left everything to him, remember? I can't get involved again now. <sighs> Father, like I said, it's all yours. Go and get them, Twan. Hmm. Go forth, my son. A new era is waiting for you to seize it. Very well. You have entrusted Wu to me, and I will not let you down. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I, that concludes the pursuit of Shochun. If you like today's battle, hit that like button, if you will, and comment on what do you think of today's battle and Taishu Bonking enemies 
as he does <laughs> with these his twin rods. Bonking and yeeting this this episode is. Anywho, if you wanna follow up on Wu Story Mode's What If route, I highly suggest subscribing to the channel. But until the next episode, ladies and gentlemen, take care and have a nice day. See you in the next episode. GG.